Collaboration, it's a term we use so often in our professional world today, but what does it really mean? A group of people coming together to work toward an outcome, but it is so much more complex than that, isn't it? We believe that collaboration requires a very disciplined methodology, but as leaders, there are a few specific things we would want you to take into consideration when it comes to collaborating effectively. First of all, People talk all the time about collaboration, but there's not a lot of action that comes out of that. It can't happen unless you're willing to roll up your sleeves and do the work, not delegating everything and really putting our words into action. Secondly, as leaders, we have to recognize that collaboration is not a sign of weakness. The greatest innovation comes from minds coming together and sharing the greatest ideas to come up with the one idea that you need to embark on. And we cannot let power get in the way of collaboration. Last but not least, collaboration has to be part of your culture. It has to be not only expected, but it has to be promoted. That you're not just always working one-on-one -on -one with people, but that you are bringing teams of people together so that you too are showing and exemplifying how collaboration can work at its best. Recognize that it is not a weakness and that it has to be inherently part of your culture because true innovation can't be accomplished without it.